This is my kingdom. All right, how are these mountain dragons doing today? What is going on in here? How's it going guys? So, my reptiles can be pretty weird sometimes. In today's video, we're just going to look at some of the weird things they get up to. So like you just saw, I often catch the dragons sitting in some pretty weird positions and these Boyd's Forest dragons are no exception. They're sitting pretty normal right now, but oftentimes when they sort of relax a bit or if they're sleeping, they find some pretty funny looking positions. Just the other night, I caught this boy sitting like this. And he was just vibing out hard. I don't know what he was dreaming about. I think it had something to do with flying or floating. You might have thought he was levitating in his sleep, but <laughs> they're really funny and the babies as well do some pretty funny stuff. So the babies like to be particularly weird and sometimes they end up sleeping like this upside down. And I've even got pictures of some of the little hatchlings just hanging on with one claw off the ceiling and sleeping like that. It's pretty ridiculous. These dragons are just crazy. The Gillen's monitor is also really similar to the dragons. He hangs in weird positions. Sometimes he's just hanging off logs and stuff with just his back legs. Or even sometimes right up in the back corner there's a little lip underneath the lid and he squeezes in there and sleeps there overnight. So he's a pretty funny little character as well. Why are you out? It's the middle of winter. I don't think the skinks are excused from this. These guys are weird in their own way. Check out what happened yesterday. So I'm up here at the reptile pits. Just giving a little check up on some of the blotchies. And uh, this male is inside here, you know, as he should be. Very down, you know, I give him these nice luscious boxes full of nice dry hay they can bury in and, you know, be out of the elements through winter, you know. Perfect. They should love it. They all love it, except uh, the female in this enclosure, she uh, decides to go missing. So, I end up digging down, right down. Bit further, bit further, there she is, right there, under the sand, under the mulch, and unbelievable, <laughs> I don't know how she's, why she thinks this is a good idea, but yeah, look at that, these bloody lizards, oh, and now you're going to huff and puff at me, look at this thing. What are you doing? Blotchies. They're insane. Now I'm going to dust her off, get her back in the box, and then in a few days she'll probably be back there under the sand again. So the blueies can also be really weird when it comes to feeding time. So if your reptiles have any weird habits, let me know. Send me a picture or a message on my Facebook page, Coops Reptiles or at Coops Reptiles World, and I'll make a follow-up video showing everyone your reptiles' weird habits. So that's just a few of the weird things my reptiles do. Thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you next time.